In the final week of the regular season, Hiller Girls Soccer took on Ashland on Monday, October 25th. Hiller's netted a goal in the first half. And Marchetti sends it back to the keeper. And now it's taken by DuPont. Shot! Hit! Go, Hillers! Joanna DuPont with a steal. Puts it in. In the second half, Hiller strike multiple times. Up to Butler. Burt Whistle skates it through, looking for DuPont. Here goes DuPont towards the net. Shot! Goal! Hillers! DuPont on the goal, Burt Whistle on the assist, and the Hillers lead it two to nothing. Nearly dropped. But imagine uh, the ball is a bit slick with the weather we've had throughout the whole afternoon. Recupero. Nina takes a shot, and it's in! Nina Zaganatis puts it in to make it a three nothing Hillers lead. Burt Whistle sneaking through. Burt Whistle sends it over. Butler with a long shot, and it's in! Wow, long distance goes Ashley Butler. Hopkinton takes the game over Ashland, four to nothing. Next stop is the playoffs. Also on Monday, October 25th, Hiller Girls Volleyball hosted Lincoln Sudbury, Steve Sweetapple and Matt Clancy on the call. Sam, Catherine, back to Gilday. Oh. Uh, and that's it. Lincoln Sudbury takes the first set, 31-29. Oh, what a, what what a, a serve. Unbelievable way to close out the set. Hopkinton takes the second set, 25 to 15. Wow. That was an improvement, Matt. That was an un just an amazing, amazing set. I mean, it was so great to see them come together as a group and play as a team. Still set point for their match point for the Hillers. Meg with a bump. Catherine, Gilday, and that's it. There you go. Hopkinton takes the fourth set, 25-17 for a 3-1 win. Hopkinton took the win 3-1 and improved to 19-0. and On Wednesday, October 27th, Hiller Girls Volleyball finished out the regular season hosting Westwood. Steve Sweetapple and Matt Clancy on the call. That's going to be a free ball. <clears throat> Excuse me, Sam gets it. Catherine, KP. Got it. Got it. That's out. So Hopkinson takes the first set, 25 to 22. Lou handles that, going to McKim. Sam, armbar, Abby. KP puts it to the back line. They go outside to Lou, and she sails that long. And they wanted a tip, but they didn't get it. Hopkinson takes that second set. 25-15. Oh, it's gonna oh, go. What a yes! Play. <laughs> what a Mel doesn't play. even believe that, and that's it. Hopkinson takes the third set, 25-15 for a 3-0 sweep. Wow, and, CBL champs. Yeah. What a way to end it. Mel, Mel was in disbelief <laughs> that that went over. Hopkinton takes the win via a 3-0 sweep and finishes a perfect 20-0 on the season. The Hillers racked up their 17th sweep of the season. Next stop is the postseason. Hillers Field Hockey wrapped up the season with a 3-1 win on the road versus Medfield. They pick up their second win to close out their season. On Friday, October 29th, Hiller Boys Soccer battled Westwood to wrap up the regular season. Hillers netted a goal in the first half. 
Looking for Golombuski, driving in. Off of Golombuski, a live ball, shot, score, Hillers! Sean Golombuski makes it one to nothing. At 27.48 left to go in the first half. Hopkinton nets two more in the second half. Send in the Ito from Schnorr. Back to Schnorr. In front of the net. And it is put in. And that was Shaw, Ryan Shaw with the goal. Into Schnorr, lifts it. Far side, Dima Kelly. Kelly matched up with Roberts. Works his way in, out in front. Schnorr, shot, goal! And the Hillers lead it three to nothing. What a great setup by Dima Kelly. As Schnorr pops it in. Hillers take the win three to one and close out the regular season in style with a 13-4 and one record.